Less than a minute. Come on. Come on. We're here. How you guys doing? Matt, JB, what's happening? Like what kind of what kind of show is are you guys running here? We were promised a 7:30 prompt start time. <clears throat> Do have to go grab the uh, medicine. Not tall enough. Hello. Cracking open my Dr. Better. Dr. Better to the rescue. Get out of here, Tommy. <clears throat> Is he starting already? Yes. First first out the gate. <laughs> We call Tommy Dr. Better. <laughs> yeah, see. With a cherry on top. Is he available? You trying to get Jake? I would treat Jake better, I'll tell you that. I don't, yeah, I don't even, I've never even, no, you, we saw one, right? Yeah, we you saw one. one. We know. We know. We know. We know. Oh, we know. We know how cruel you can be. <laughs> Is he gone? You need a missing or person? Missing? What do you say? Missing persons? Miss no. What? Well, APB sure. or something? It's like an acronym. <clears throat> I'll find him. You know I'm a detective. <laughs> So if you need to find him, I'm in. Give me his full name and birthday. <laughs> MIA could be. What's up, JB? What is up? No, when someone's missing, you put out an APB. I'll post both All in. points. Points. That's what you do when you're looking for somebody. <clears throat> Oh, you cold? How cold is it there? We still in the 50s here. Nope. Not anymore? What are we in? 47. We have 47, y'all. Yeah. Getting down to 41 tonight. Woo! It's gonna be a cold one. Dan supposedly fixed the internet, but I keep freezing, so... What? He said he fixed it. I did. I ran a speed test right before we started. You no, know, you clear as day over here. Nah, I keep freezing. Nah. I'm like, eh, 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 eh. like no, nope. not on this screen. What's up, Teresa? How you doing? <laughs> All right, we are finishing out this haul. I cannot wait to be done listing these clothes. This thing is pretty sweet. I know. I don't know what it is. Twenty one. Twenty one what? Fahrenheit. That's very cold. What is this? A, sh a shrug? Mm, it's like a shawl. It's a shawl. A shawl? Mm -hmm. What brand is it? Soft surroundings. What's up, CT? How you doing? <clears throat> it's a one size. CT is in the house tonight. CT is in the house tonight. You better be on your best behavior. You and Tommy are going to be cracking up in here. It's done on the way up, though. It doesn't work. The older stuff doesn't work. This doesn't even have one. Yeah, I need you to turn my computer. <coughs> Someone's got to do the listings, right? Am I right? I've right. already done 20 today. 20. We're going for 30. I have had help on the photos, though. Dan's having an issue. Come back to you. What was the issue? It was sticking. 
<laughs> All right, here we go tonight. Okay. This thing is made out of silk, acrylic, and wool. One size. It's a shrug, y'all. It's a shrug. No, I said it was a shawl. It's a shawl. It's not a shrug. You sure? Yeah, shrug has sleeves. It's no sleeves. No sleeves. Shawl. Soft ceramic shawl. Picked up a vintage Woolridge denim dress with a Christmas embroidery. I bet it sells like a right away. You said it's the ugliest thing. I bet you it sells so quick. Don't even doubt it for one second. <clears throat> yeah, man, because we, we sold a bunch of stuff super fast. Yep. Last night that we listed the night before and last night. Stuff is moving. <clears throat> we used to do 10 a day, but we have been, I don't know, branching out into the 30 a day realm. For K, we have a, a person taking pictures. So that helps. A lot. Yeah, it really does. We're also listing, as you know, so it's like <clears throat> the double doozy. Green floral embroidered. Is that embroidered? Mm hmm. Why do you think I don't say this word? No, no, I never can say this word. It like, gets all caught up in my throat. <laughs> Hey Kim, how you doing? Oh, you found Gucci's at the Salvation? Okay. I thought you only had Zara at your Salvation. Okay. <clears throat> Gucci what? Okay. People were blinded by the Zara and you found the Gucci. <laughs> I did find the Zara. <laughs> Hello, Angela and Amanda. Both are here tonight. <clears throat> Rockin' and rollin'. Hold on, you got a, you got a, like a hair on here. Got it. Thank you. That's cute. It's got a little ruffle. I'm yeah, ruffle. Right? Can I fit ruffle? Ah. Come on, no. There's no size on this, right? There's one size. Embroidery ruffle. What's up, what's up? What are you guys listening to tonight? Come on now. List with us, please. He's so lonely. What's the number? Mm, I don't know. Amanda, how's your phone? <laughs> How your phone charge doing? Check in. What are you doing? Yeah, see the last number over here. Left. Oh, we have our numbers. Bro, get the numbers. Okay. It's, it's going to be um, 70, 17. Mm, could it be shoes? Shoes, shoes, shoes? Oh, my kid has an ear infection. Oh, no. I listed all cheap jeans today. What do you mean you're at 33%? What does, oh, your phone. Cheap jeans. Did you get them in thread up or something? Or are you buying cheap jeans? What's happening there? Listing plushies. We've sold two plush today on eBay since where we filmed our video. So the only thing we've sold is plush. I guess list your plush. I don't know. Yeah, two things. Plush. How many offers is on either eBay a little bit dead right now? Those are phases. We sold 15 today. I'm not mad about that. But it's, it has been going in phases. We have not celebrated Scoop 7,000. Oh. Whoa. We didn't actually hit 7,000. You see, we had to give April our 6,000 our six thousand number <laughs> skew. Whoa. The roll. And so we need to jump into seven. But she's going to do 
she's gonna catch up to us. <clears throat> we should probably go to eight, to be honest. Ha! Ah, whoa. Because she's gonna catch up to us way faster. Yeah, that's for sure. She lives like a hundred things a day. <clears throat> it's crazy. I gave her a, like hundred and five things to do, and she's almost done. I gave them to her two days ago. Mm. Yikes. She probably is done. I don't even know. Maybe say give away. Give away. Some give away. What do you want? Some Eileen Fishers. Some record queens. I don't know. Nice. 800 listings today. There you go. A lot of work. I brought the bags too. Okay, you should try them. They're bigger. For this, it might be better. No cheap stuff. Say it louder for the people in the back. We are listing Chico's and some other stuff in the state. So don't use those stock photos. They will come after you. Chico's is the worst. Chico's and Black Market are the same company. And they will take you down. They will ruin your career. <clears throat> Hi, Cameron. How are you? So it looks like it's just two bags of 500. Instead of 10 bags of 400. Okay. I don't care. I don't either. I think those bags are a better size and good fit. I'm just trying to off. figure out how I'm going to. Oh, you never use stock photos? Oh, <laughs> me either. <laughs> <laughs> right. I was crossing my fingers. Oh, is that what was happening? I, well, sometimes Dan's photos are messed up. What are you supposed to do? Right? Sometimes they're just terrible. Sorry. <laughs> I'm like, I got to stock. That's what you wanted to say. Seriously, I'll be like, I got to stock. He's like, oh, thank God. <laughs> Sometimes. But we do not use stocks for Chico's or White House Black Market. No. For Jim Shark. No. Don't do it. Do not do it. Oh, maybe you got like a trash bag of reseller stuff. So there was an estate sale and I was looking and there were bins in the garage with numbers on the bins. I was like, oh, that's a reseller. <laughs> <coughs> that's what happens when you die. Your reseller stuff goes to an estate sale. What can you do? Bins and all. What can you do? People be going through our bins and bags. Dang. Oh, weird. We just reordered new t-shirt bags and SKU numbers and scotch tape in case anyone's yeah. keeping tabs on our inventory. Do that stuff for the end of the year so you can write it up. Later. I'm still at work. Oh, I'm <coughs> to put on a break, having to cover my coworkers. But everyone is getting sick of all this. Oh, oh no. Cameron, are you wearing a mask? Do not sit. Everyone's getting sick with the flu. COVID, RSV, all of them. Anything. Trifecta. Yo, bro, do you think this? I know, right, Kyle? Kyle, like, bruh, I've been sitting here for 45 minutes doing listed anything. Hey, I'm trying. Kyle's coming after you. I'm trying. <laughs> God. Oh, man. All right. Oh, so where have you been? 70, 17? He's like 17, yeah. No, we need to check up on Kyle because you've been missing for a couple of nights now, a couple of weeks. Because <coughs> we went on vacation. Where you been? Where we been? Is we been in Mexico. The more appropriate question. Love Mexico. I'll go back so to fun. Love Mexico. Yo, bro. Came in hot. <laughs> Do you even list? Wait, so there's no size on this, right? It, the tag just says OS. What size? I so, haven't listed a single thing today, which is not normal, but I kind of have a case of the effort. I get these all the time. Oh, man, all the time. So it's real apparent when I have them, and then Dan comes to me and he's like, Do you have the effort? And I'm like, <laughs> Absolutely. And he's like, Where are we going? <laughs> and then I'm like, I think we need to go to LA. And he's like, All right. He knows. Yep. And then he makes it happen. He starts looking for flights. He's like, I got you, girl. I got you. I get on real bad. It's like a clinical case. What are you going to do? And when I have the evidence, I have to travel. That's the only, there's the only one cure. That is it. What's the material? Oh, you tell me. It's not very large. Wool blend. That's what you're going to put. Wool. 
That's why I've seen if those bigger bags will help you. You said they were going to make all the difference. <coughs> no. Well, I I will throw some things up before bed tonight. Yeah, you will. Just a little little baby. Little babies are easy. You can just like do the front, the back. You got any plush? Plush is the easiest thing ever to lose. Besides that and vacuum cleaner bags, <laughs> I do not recommend them. I have a little issue with the vacuum cleaner bags. Okay. I mean, I can't get it to close. That's not bad. Don't spend time on it, baby. Priority. Can you get it in a flat rate? I don't know. I don't know. It's got to test it. Doesn't even look like it. Are you wasting time here? Is it good? Good time to waste? All right. Yeah, good. Grabbing it. <laughs> yeah, that'll work. I'm just going to leave it in there. <laughs> because it's definitely shipping in there. Perfect. Aw, oh, bye, Cameron. Have fun at work. I hope you get off soon. We'll miss you. That's all right. I just, I just good. cut my losses there. <laughs> All right, these pictures better be good. Oh, God. Pressure's on. What's this thing? $50. I wish we had plush. We don't have any right now, but I would be listening. It. I love listening. It. it takes so little time. And if you can sell it for $50 or more, it's the same as clothes. Yeah. It takes way less time to list. That's what I'm saying. I'm trying to be realistic about it. But you can't buy every plush. This is the issue we ran into. We got real excited about it. Yeah, we had a lot still here. When I say we, I just... <laughs> Didn't get overly excited about the plush. <clears throat> I did. Prospect. Had, had a little moment. Had a moment. He was buying everything. And now we're like, no, 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 no. So we don't do that. Oh, this does. Oh, this does. Sweet. Yeah, that one has a box. Sweet. Sweet. That's why I brought it. All right. All right, here we go. We're going to roll through these. We need to get, I think, 10 done to meet our goal today. 10 quality listings. Not just anything, kids. Not just anything. Sometimes. Okay, so when I say three quarters, I mean like seven eighths. Wait, what? You know, the, the turnout. Oh, okay. It wants to be a little less than a true three quarters. Always, but I just like never say anything. I'm saying something. Also, can you put it in? <coughs> can I what? You know, when it's like hanging out. What do you want me to do with it? Pull it. The white music. Because I can't crop it. Look what I mean. It looks like Terminator coming out of its butt. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't go down one. I'll, I'll try. Okay. Makes sense. Yep. Or I'll fix it in the photo Terminator butt. <laughs> There's so many lives. Go have fun. Go date around. It's fine. <laughs> We're just listing boring old lady clothes. Oh, man. It's fine. It's old fine. We'll clothes. understand. Amanda cannot decide where she wants to be. Too many lives at one time. I don't know of any other lives that are going on. Should we be at another live? <laughs> <laughs> no clue. Does not have a shawl collar. I know that that is that is true. A little fragrant. Uh oh. A little bit. A little bit. You guys are my first love. It's okay, but we understand. Your tastes change. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, this is a cake for sure. 
that's the greatest part about not being monetized. Y'all can go do whatever you want. We'll, just, <laughs> we'll sit here and talk to the void. It's fine. It's just fine. It'll be fine. You know me, I could talk to a wall. He's like, well, 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 well. you teaching them about our right. strategies. <laughs> Just let those videos on the other channel run overnight, you know. <laughs> Keep them running, kids. We're paying April with that money. Please, God, please. <clears throat> All right. This is a robe. Is this what it's what is? It's J. Jill Sleep. J. Jill Sleep. It's a 4X. Coral robe plus size. I don't know if the robes go for much, but at 46 cents plus size, how can you go wrong? Yeah. Shawkala. That's pretty much it. Okay, it's fine. I'm just going to copy one of these. It's fine. With so much shade gel sleep, and it's just their pajama line, I guess. And I was worried about having so much of it. And then we listed the first thing, and it sold in 10 minutes. <laughs> do people go on the internet and look for sleepwear? Me thinks they do. And they do. <clears throat> I, I wear stuff that's, like, not intended for sleepwear to sleep. You know what I'm saying? Like, my old Nirvana t-shirt and some boxers. Do you want to know what this is actually called? Yeah, I do. The Sleep Ultra Soft Belted Long Robe. Belted Long Robe. That was pretty close. Um, anyway, so I can't believe that people go on the internet and buy specific sleep stuff. That's amazing. That's amazing. I don't know. I guess once you find something you really like, I've never found something I really like because I just sleep, you know? <laughs> You're like, ooh, I want that in every color. <clears throat> That's what I'm saying, right? Amanda, you don't have, like, specific sleep stuff. I try to get a sp specific sleep stuff, and I never end up wearing it. I always go to my comfies. I did try, though. I was like, I'm going to be an adult. I'm going to be an adult this time. I think it was, like, <laughs> I'm going to really year. do it. <laughs> I'm going to wear pajamas. I try to get some like little button down, you know, like a little situation, like a little, you know, with the piping. I was like, I'm gonna get some pajamas. <laughs> no, didn't work out. No. Do not wear. Hey, is that cotton? Some kind of blend. Cotton blend stretch. Like, does that sound good? That sounds that's, amazing. Does that stretch? Can't fit it. It does. What's the number it on this? It is cotton modal sixty forty. I'm gonna try to fit it into a bag, but I don't know. I just don't know yet. It's so cold. I'm wearing a turtleneck under a nightgown. Oh my lord! And socks. Oh my gosh! See, no matter how cold it is outside, this moment is a sweat ball. I am so hot at night. Dan's like, it's sixty. And I'm like, I can't. I'm like, I. <laughs> And she's like, I, it's so hot. I'm like, open the window. <laughs> Actually quite volatile in our house at night. We fight about the, the temperature. <laughs> We've never had a real fight in our life. But if there was ever to be one and there was a knockdown drag out, it would be over the temperature at night. <laughs> oh, man. I'm sure. There's no way this is going to fit into it. Just put it in a tie bag. Why do you take on these challenges that are not um, challenges? I haven't even tried to do it yet. No, but like, why do you even try? I wasn't. You like rev yourself up for it. You're like, oh, this is gonna fit. No, I'm just as I'm folding it, I notice that, that it's obviously way too big. Dan and I are also middle of the day showers. You're not alone, Amanda. We shower during the middle of the day, all the time. Like we both are just like, ah, I want to shower right now. Like very random. And then sometimes we both want to shower. I'm like, hi, ah, we want to do. And then we have to like flip. You go first. But 
that is another issue. We have a two portion shower over share. We've seen my shower. And but he like I, I shower too hot, so we can't shower at the same time. <laughs> He's like, ah, ah, the whole time. <laughs> and then his shower's like cold. I'm like, what are you doing? This is too cold. Whatever. Whatever. Best laid plans. We used to have to like, you know, fight over the shower at our studio condo. So we were like, no, we're getting a two person shower. We can't we can't use it. Can't thing. handle it. He's like, oh my god, that's scalding. <laughs> oh good. Use these robes. Okay, what's the shipping on that, you think? It can't fit in a flat race. It's got a shoe wiggle, huh? I mean, I'll have been able to, like, squish it, squish it. Well, how much do I weigh? One pound ten. Oh, everyone else charged the nights. You have no hot water. So you're by default. Thing. We gotta. We try to prevent that as well by getting a. We have like an instant. Uh, we call that tankless. It's a tankless. It's not a. It's not instant though. We instant. thought it would be more instant than it is. Yeah. We like upgraded and everything. We sometimes in. it takes a while to get through those cold pipes. It You're takes like, a on. long time. Come on. Thought we were gonna have a better situation. What's the number? <clears throat> 70. 70, it is not that good. No, not at all. You gotta have but one of those. It's better than. Was. Yeah, but you gotta have one of those like boilers. One of those instants. Yeah, that like sits under your sink or your shower or whatever. It's have in England. Everybody has those. You don't have to wait at all. Because they want to save water, you see. Mm -hmm. We don't care. I care, but America doesn't care is what I'm saying. As a whole. Man, at our other condo, we'd have to leave the water running with the kitchen sink water for like, like 10 minutes. It, sometimes it was ridiculous to get yeah. any hot water to wash our dishes, which is like a sanitation <laughs> situation. <laughs> we have a gas water heater. Do we have gas water heater? I believe the tank was this gas. Yes. Yeah, I think we have a gas one as well, but it still takes a while. I'm here for you, Kyle. Anything you want to know, I'm here for your job except discussion. <laughs> Made to say, Kyle, what time do you shower? <laughs> <laughs> I love this. All right, what brand is this? Um, this is Bob Mackey. This is not nightwear, right? Mr. Mackey. No, this is wearable <laughs> art. I'm Bob Mackey, I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Matt? Where's Matt on the all caps here? I'm good. Oh my god. It's probably someone else's live. Probably. Oh no, he did. Yeah. He came in right on time. <laughs> so anyway. All right. You want a style number or something? All right. It says Bob Mackey wearable art. A64388. 100% silk. Size 1X. Bob Maggie reminds me of Cher. You ain't wrong about that. Who is not wrong? This is like a Mandarin Super, yes. situation. Totally. Yes. That's it. I wasn't so leave. <laughs> you like on Titanic. I'll never let go. <laughs> I'm going to make a beam of you. <laughs> <laughs> Matt and Dan on this little like freaking board that could have fit both of them. <laughs> Easily. Could have fit them both. Oh, I'll never let go. Do it. She like on that I know. She was like, eh. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? Bye. She's like, my hands are kind of cold. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, everyone's chiming in with when they shower. I love this group. <laughs> hey, is that silk? It these, is. these are not worth that much. I'll just have you it know. One hundred percent so. Okay. And what So um, what you're saying is it's not taking not worth the time to freaking yep. these buttons. Now you need to see the buttons. 
Matt Char is 6.37-ish. Yikes. <laughs> no, you can't. That's when our live starts. No, a.m. Oh, p.m. No, he like a night oh, charge. He's charged before our lives. That makes sense. You want to be clean. I was right ready to work. A.m. Hey, duh. You work as a chef. What Definitely is? not a.m. Wait, what size was it? 1X. Same ones. Oh man. Listed nineteen ninety nine. Oh, it's sold for nineteen ninety nine. All the buttons. Oh, yeah. there's more. They were fighting. It's sold. There's a sold though. Love that. Stupid buttons. Bruh. I need you to calm down. No, they're really bad. <laughs> <laughs> Green Mandarin. I can't put situation Mandarin style. <laughs> you should though. <laughs> Mandarin sitch. Sitch. Sutton. I like an occasional bath, but I showered out. Okay. Both baths in our house are broken. Broke. Broken. Okay, one of them Dan never hooked up. He promised me he would two years ago, literally two years at this point. Never got hooked up. To be fair, a stupid plumber contractor should have done that, but yeah. Okay, still my master bath <clears throat> bathtub. I have a claw foot bathtub. Never got hooked up. So it serves as a laundry bin. It's one big, huge laundry bin. You can just throw it into the bathtub. And then I broke the other bathtub trying to soak clothes, and the thing was way too heavy, and I broke the faucet. Like, the plumbing inside the faucet is broke. So you'd have someone come sweat it back on. Go sweat it! Tommy forgets to shower a lot. Same. <laughs> Both of us. Tell me down in the basement like a troll for 40 days and 40 <laughs> nights. I can't. What's the number I said? I can't figure out what number we're on. Oh, 719. 70. 40. 70. 70, 19. What? 40. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> so our shower. When we got it, we just got, you know, a gut job of our house. But we, we did everything else, but we didn't do the bathrooms because I don't do tile or plumbing. And they didn't slope the shower correctly. Oh, my God. It's... It is the effing worst. I feel so privileged saying this, but I'm about to rip the whole thing up and get it redone. Because we have to squeegee our shower every time just to make sure, like, it doesn't rot out, right? That the water's not standing. We have to squeegee our shower. So I don't want to take a shower ever. I'm like, I don't want to squeegee it. <laughs> Before I even get in, I'm like, oh, my God. I'm <laughs> I got to squeegee it. No. <laughs> I hate squeegeeing it. Squeegee. And then we have this specialist come look at me. He's like, yeah, bro, you have squeegee. <laughs> I'm like, no. <laughs> Why? We had a really bad experience with our bathroom remodel. Like, it was real bad. And it was supposed to be a friend. But, oh. That's the worst. That's the worst. When a friend does you wrong. Did not do right by us. We still don't have a threshold or a bathtub hookup. How can you say someone's bathroom is done and the bathtub's not hooked up? <laughs> like, what? Well, there's no bathtub. Yeah. He was like, I'm done. There was no threshold. We were missing doorknobs. Like, all the finishing was not done. There's no caulk in our bathroom at all. We're like, oh. So Dan calls and was like, bruh. You ain't done. He's like, oh no, I'm done. Trying to do a whole thing. It was a thing. There was a big old fight. But it was like, not a fight because Dan. It was like a Dan fight. <laughs> <laughs> Wildly ineffective. <laughs> Got no money back. <laughs> What's up, Kristen? Where are you at? <laughs> Everyone's talking about not showering. <laughs> Wet wipes are best. <laughs> oh, Tommy uses his butt crack as a barometer. Okay. Starts to smell things, then he knows it's time. <laughs> hey, our ancestors in Victorian times, they like sponge bath once a month. So I'm sure it got real ripe. Real ripe. Mm -hmm. It was not that bad it was not that serious what i'm saying we shower way more than we need to I'm, you're fine Tom. you'll be fine illinois what part wait where, where's the bin there's a good good village <clears throat> that we know about it was a really good will 
good Goodwill. In Chicago. Chicago. Coffee Kings in the Midwest. No. <laughs> I love John Candy. Oh. <laughs> oh. Rip. Seriously. Yeah. That one hit me hard. Still think about him all the time. Him and Chris Farley. They're basically brothers. You know what I mean? Brother from another mother. Oh, yeah, John. We're down to kind of the dregs of what we had in the hall, so bear with us. Well, Dan seen some good things, actually. Yeah, there's a couple of good ones. What I brought in might be kind of draggy. Draggy! It was dark, so I couldn't see what I brought in, to be fair. <clears throat> I just took the things off the rack. I was like, what? <laughs> Looks like it's going to be you guys. Brother from another planet! Shut up, Kyle. Kristen, if you want, you can tell us what color your pajamas are. And when you shower, you forgot the most important part. I was just making a point. I didn't know if you wanted to freaking freaking internet spy pajamas. <coughs> Kyle's offended. We offended him. Offended? Yes. Oh, Gets easily offended. That guy. <laughs> He doesn't like to hear about our underwear. Larry. He looks all right. Pictures look good. Well, man, he Okay. <laughs> Some people love Bob Mackie to this day. Like, we go to estate sales and they have the whole closet full of only Bob Mackie. I'm like, you do your boo boo. <laughs> hey, is that Bob Mackie first class or priority? Pretty sure it's first class. We didn't chat about this. It's yeah, very light. It's very, very light. Important information. Very, very light. Drugs are bad. Okay, okay seven, seven ounces. Okay. Christmas jammies bath every night. Boom. See? There you go, Kristen. There you go. My point was being at the uh, estate sale we went to, we got a ton of pajamas, and I was not sure that they would sell. Because, like, who goes on the internet to buy pajamas? Don't you just wear whatever you have in your house that's, like, not good anymore and you just wear it? That's what I do. No. And then Kyle got offended. Like, he always does. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, Kyle. Cass. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Join me, Cartman. Cass. Yeah. That is not TMI. Kristen, why can't I talk about this? Really? We cannot talk about what we sleep in. Anyway, it's fine. Fine. The J. Jill sleep is doing very well. People are buying it. That was the point That's of the, the story. <laughs> All right. And what is this? This is a soft surroundings crinkle shirt. Well, a crinkle shirt. Oh, Love Kyle's just crinkle. mad that no one asked him what he sleeps in. We know what you sleep in. <laughs> <laughs> We know. Everybody knows already. Glands and Pima Cotton. Hey, all this stuff we're listing is Pima Cotton. Is this like a thing? Maybe I should try some. You should probably try it. Christmas is coming. Maybe I should ask for some Pima Cotton PJs. Dude, maybe you can get them off eBay. I don't know if I want to sleep. Cause people sleep in the clothes for like eight hours and they get kind of sweaty. I don't know if I want to. I don't know if I want to go there. I don't like to buy things that are close to people's skin. Is that weird being a reseller? <laughs> Lands and PJs are the best? I didn't know this. Not I bet if you feel like that, other people do too. <clears throat> Tony, are you lurking in the chat? <laughs> lurking in the live? Aw, Chrissy, you're so sweet. She shared more than she normally would. You're just... You're just so comfortable here. Kyle makes you comfortable. Crinkle shirts make me comfortable because you don't have to steam them. That's right. Love a crinkle shirt. No, they were not pre-loved. They were new old stock, Matt. Get it correctly. 
I will sell a douche. No, I didn't find an enema. I only found a douche. I will sell it. It was new old stock. It was single, baby. I'll sell anything if I make me a buck. I don't care. Is there something I won't sell? I'm trying to think. I don't think there's something I won't sell. Chris is like, oh, steam stuff. I feel. All right, JB, I'm going to go land's end after this look. Do they have baby, baby sizes, kid sizes? Women's. What size is this? 2X. We got a new Lands End store up there by the Whole Foods. Oh, really? By the Nordstrom Rack. Hmm. Yeah. Do they have kids stuff? Oh, they have kids. And guns? Perfect. Oh. What? Oh, good. Megan's home after the Candyland game. Was it life size? The library had crafts. I love a craft. So we went to the art museum when I first moved to Dallas and I just sat in a craft center that was meant for kids, but I didn't know it was meant for kids. <laughs> I sat there the whole time making crafts and Dan was like, true story. Did you want to go see the art? I was like, oh, sorry. Not really. They had crafts. They had like God's eyes and I was in it. In it. <clears throat> CT, talking about sleeping in the birthday suit. Some people do. It's too cold in my house to sleep in your birthday suit. Literally, it's 60 degrees in the house. So you could try. What's the number? 7020. You could try it at eBay camp. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. You guys need to have different switchy nannies. What? How do I know who I'm talking to? I told Teresa, be on your best behavior. Now Teresa here. Be on your best behavior. CT was like, it ain't Teresa. So now I'm telling you. First class. First class. Wait, two X? Yeah. Two X. Two X, two X, two X. Nah. I thought you was listing. Did you get anything listed? Two X. This is my best behavior. Am I? Cost trolling hardcore. <laughs> uh, just so you know, it's as good as it gets. We love you, Kyle. We love you just the way you are. Don't make me start singing because it will. I'll Billy Joel you. She will. Don't go changing. I will. All right. What? Let me see what the price of this one. It was just like 20 bucks. That was 32. Going to 32. 32. Let's do it. This picture's coming. Thank you. I try out here to have good behavior. <laughs> <laughs> oh, everybody's trying. I appreciate y'all trying. I cursed on here the other night. It was not my finest moment. Oh, I didn't mean to. It sure did. Roll the tape. It just, just, <laughs> epic. It came out real fast. I couldn't even control it. I said, whoopsie. <laughs> but it's not monetized. It's all good. Say what you matter. want to. You can monetize your lighter drop with a casual. Really? Fine. Yeah, what are the it's... rules? How many can you do? I don't know. It doesn't give you a number. Well, then how do you know what the rules are? <clears throat> I have to check it every time I upload a video. Shut up, Matt. <laughs> <laughs> Where I'm from, Billy Joeling means something different. No, it doesn't. <laughs> that is not a derogatory. <laughs> I don't even know if I got laughing. <laughs> that is not a derogatory term. Uh, I can't even imagine. I can't either. Would it be but... like drunk driving? <laughs> There's nothing. He got a DM was on Instagram. Send us an email. No, you're making this up. You're making it up. <laughs> it's just a signal for a DUI. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, what is this? Uh, uh, what is this? Good question. Foxcroft from Apple Seeds. Size 22W. Oh, 
Oh, I love this mannequin. Look. Mm. Look at this. Mm. Oh, yeah. Come on. Attitude. Have attitude. I'm saying. I can't think about this. I don't even understand. Think about giving someone a Billy Joel. Okay, I get it. I get the acronym. <laughs> but who says that? <laughs> Nobody says that. I've never heard that. Anymore. Nobody's heard that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. So fancy and gold. That's what I was saying. Oh, people. <laughs> Foxcroft four apple seeds, not the front. What did you say? It was 22? Yeah. Cup and Polly. This might be a style number. It's okay, I guess. Cool. You said cotton poly? Mm hmm. 60 40. Number? 70 20. 70 20. <laughs> 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 Isn't that good? You're taking me out! <laughs> <laughs> I got to go. I have, I'm dead. D E B, I tell you. <laughs> you all can't go trolling on Jake's lives. You have to do it here. <laughs> you know, let it out. It's fine. <laughs> he would have shut the computer by now. <laughs> this stream has ended unexpectedly. <laughs> oh, Kyle is letting us know he's being good. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Kyle. Kyle. Much appreciated. We appreciate you. I have listed so much today. Also, so we've listed 20 things. I cross-listed like 20, 50 things, and I re-listed 30 things. I have been listing all freaking day. I seriously thought about going live again, but who's live during the day? Like, who's doing anything? I don't want to be talking to myself like a crazy person. <laughs> be bad while I'm gone. We will. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Oh my god, you need to stop it. <clears throat> you don't need to stop and talk about them dead people like that. That's not right. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that one night comment for someone about somebody dead that died like four hours ago? <laughs> Too soon? Too soon? <laughs> no, it was like four minutes. It was like four seconds, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Too soon? I don't even remember who it was now. Damn. Too soon? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> no. Never. <Nah, nah. laughs> kind of rolling. Rolling. Really close. We're a little more comfortable. First class for sure. A little more comfortable with them now, so we go faster. I swear it matters. It's like a brand new brand or like a brand new style. We both get slower. No less, no sell. This is so true. Did what was your? <laughs> I called it a test. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't list it, it in fact will not sell. Thank right. you for doing that on behalf of all of us. We appreciate your scientific qualifications. How many things have you listed? 
Is everybody listening? I'm telling you, this is the final push. People are going to be buying. We have 10 days till Christmas, which means if you have one day shipping, it shows like five days out. So they have the next five days are going to be banging. This should weekend be. Yeah. should be off the charts. I know people are going to go out to the regular stores and everybody's going to make those excuses. But really, if you have things like any kind of collectibles or like rando things that people type in, like we sold a snowy owl plush. So somebody's <laughs> grandchild definitely likes snowy owls. And this person was like, "Ugh." <laughs> exactly. What do I get? You know, Brody snowy owl and they type it into google and then my ebay listing came up and they were like oh Perfect. thank god i'll get that <laughs> and it'll get here in time Woo! you know what i'm saying totally get that ish listed this is go time even if it's like weirdo stuff that might even be better also people have to show up to christmas and they have to show up to judgmental relatives so they want to <laughs> look good so list all the clothes that you have that could be worn to christmas or hanukkah dinner this is all just what I'm thinking in my head. I'm not an expert. I'm just saying. I went shopping on Poshmark yesterday. I'm thinking about doing a video on online arbitrage from not smart sellers. I don't, <laughs> I, don't I would have a better title, obviously. Yeah. Wouldn't be so offensive. I did the old you, just didn't like it search. Oh, man. <laughs> you were cracking up last night. I was, you just could not stop. So when someone has it, just didn't like it, you know, and I go into the, I go, just didn't like it. And then I price from lowest to highest. This is one of my strategies. I have many and <laughs> lowest to highest. And then I get into their closet and all their things are just didn't like it. Just didn't fit. Just didn't. I'm like, yes. <laughs> things are like three to five dollars. It's perfect. Hated it. Hated it. This is a set, correct? Correct. Uh oh, we got a sleep set. It's a Pima Cotton. I think so. Most of these have been Pima. Okay. These are the things I've been listening from April because I gave her the separates. Oh, right. Right, 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 right. Shoes all day. S H U S. <laughs> Shoes. <laughs> Dan always says small. <laughs> small. S M O L. <laughs> I ch I search just didn't like it. Matt searches shoes. What do y'all search? <laughs> oh, good. Kyle went to one day handling. Did you have any listings that wouldn't update? We have like a million listings that don't update because I send out offers 24 hours a day. So annoying. I have to go through. I have like a million copies of shipping policies because it creates a copy every time it won't update no it's not pima this is it's not a pima it's 60 cotton 40 tinsel yep. sleep ultra soft animal print henley j jill j jill start there sleep. sleep ultra soft animal print henley 60 percent cotton 40 percent tinsel mode yeah, it's tinsel. Four not like tinsel, not like Christmas tree. <laughs> not tinsel. S M. Oh, without the umlaut L. <laughs> <laughs> yes, exactly. Small. All right. Does anyone have the set? Because we have the pants with it, and they're the same size. They're already done checking. Uh, with the matching buttons on the front. See, it's matchy, same. matchies. And they're both 4X, I think? Yes. Here we go. I'm going to copy this one. So is it okay if I just do the half Cs but yeah. show the buttons? I literally had hundreds of shipping policies. I cannot take it. And they're like, we'll condense them for you. Never works. Never works. Not mm -hmm. once ever. Never no. in our life has it ever worked. <laughs> <sighs> Size 3X. 4x size 4x ultra soft oh no, i forgot what you told me hold on i got it animal print and leaf top and then the pants are obviously the same but animal print slim leg pants Um, 
is this maroon? Uh, it is a bit red. <laughs> oh, I can just do it. I know I did. Maroon. Women maroon. Yeah, that's why we always end up taking vacation when we don't need to, or time away, I mean. Because we can't get the shipping policies to, like... Yeah, <laughs> we can't get the shipping policies to update. Oh, that's annoying. Yeah, this is what's happening. Lead back. Going from there, maybe this way. There you go. Work smarter, not harder. <clears throat> sleep. Theme sleep. Okay. Oh, In the wrong field. Cotton blend, eh? Yes. Yes. Long sleeve, short sleeves, what, what's going on? Long sleeve. Oh, I can never sleep in long sleeve. Oh, I'm sweating thinking about it. Is <laughs> <laughs> it have a drawstring? I don't know. Okay. I'll let you know when I get there. Take out the... Why do I have to take out the period, JB? Really? Well, I have a lot of listings to edit if I have to take this out. Is it because it's just punctuation? Because in the brand, there's a period. Look, bam, right there. Thank you for looking out. I took it out for you. Shipping policies are definitely an issue. I had two sales on eBay today. One was the the NADS waxing strips. I had those since 2020, and I burst into laughter when they sold. Yes. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. You always say no punctuation. I do say that, Jamie. You're correct. That's why I wondered if you're saying that. I've heard no punctuation unless it's something that the algorithm or the SEO will pick up, like a brand name. But you're probably right. I probably should just be on the safe side and just type J space Jill and let the brand pick up the period. That's a good point. I will do that. Oh, so now I can type my room in full. Yes. <laughs> Hello, Jamie. Always Perfect. thinking. Always thinking ahead. <clears throat> I want to type maroon and then women. Bam. Click on your head foot. All right. So let's see here. To work on them, you have to get it in a rhythm. eBay bumps you back and forth. It sucks, but it has to be done if you want to ever adjust shipping times. Yeah, I, I, I worked on them today to get us back to one-day shipping because I changed this to three-day shipping. But, of course, we sold four things that didn't update. And so we were late on four items. Not just a little late, like mega late on four items. So Dan had to call from Mexico and be like, uh. Excuse me. We change our stuff. You didn't change it. Because I did go into the ones where it had, like, you know, dumped them over into, like, the copy of policy. And I changed every single one. I went in and changed the listings. But the ones that had offers, it didn't alert me that it didn't change. Even though I clicked on it and changed it and saved it. Because he said, the rep said, since there was an outstanding offer, that it didn't change it. And... That's annoying because I'm very meticulous about things like that. Mm -hmm. I went in and changed. I literally went into every single listing, not even bulk edit because it wouldn't let me bulk edit. I went and clicked in every single listing and changed it, and then it's still not changed. You feel? So we had to call the eBay rep. He was like, you'll be fine. No, we won't. We'll have to call again. Don't lie. He's definitely don't, calling again. Don't worry your pretty little face. <laughs> <laughs> Teresa going to come and swing, and she left, though. <laughs> <laughs> Which is basically what I got. No, no, it did say updated with errors, so I fixed all the errors. But what the rep said was even though I fixed the errors, since it had an um, offer, extending offer on it. It still didn't take. It didn't take, but it doesn't let you know that. He said it was a known problem. I said, oh, ho, ho, 
is it? Because when it lets me know, I fix it. <laughs> I would have relisted it and let the offer go, right? I just would have. I did on all the ones I thought I was doing. It wasn't that many, to be fair. It was like 12 total at the end of the day that I was unsure about because of outstanding offers. And I went in and fixed them one by one. And then four of the 12 sold, really. Really? Is that how it's going to be? That's exactly how it's going to be. <laughs> You expect that if there is offers nothing changes i know but it i relisted them like i went in not relisted that's not the right word excuse me let me go back and tell you the right word i went and edited the listing and changed the shipping policy manually and then click save and i got no error message after that no nothing so it's the known problem Why would it be? I guess the offer thing trumps, but the error message is gone. So I assumed, since there was no error, that I was okay. I was not okay. <clears throat> but the rep said we'd be okay. Don't worry. Well, I believe okay. that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. I do want to... Did I put... I put a set. I put set. Is that not good enough? Pajama set? Okay, wait, JB, let's look at the photos and then you tell me if it's good enough. Because Dan does like a thing where he puts them in the first photo, he'll put both pieces. I gotta, I gotta build it. It won't let you change. I can't change a policy with offers. But that's what I'm saying. It let me, it let me do it individually in each listing of the 12 that I had to do it on. It let me go into each one individually. And I'm telling you, nothing popped up. I just click save. No, I clicked done, and it was done. And I went to the next one. And that's why the eBay rep said we would be okay, because it's a known issue. For some people, it allows them. Like, also for us, we can't change shipping rates within a policy. If you want to charge $14.99 for something, and your shipping policy is $15.99, you got to go all the way back to the start of eBay, to the start of your store, and create a brand new shipping policy, and then go into a listing and assign it. The new listing tool is all bunged up on our um, <coughs> account. So even Dan had the problem today because he never understood what I was talking about. And then it happened to him today. Oh, yeah. It was fun times. And he was like, oh, well, I'll just create it. So it says create new shipping policy. I was like, okay, go ahead and do that. Yeah. And then it froze. And I was standing there right behind him like, uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Watch what happens. And he goes, oh, so I'll just create. Oh, <laughs> I got to go back to the beginning. I'm like, Yes. <laughs> There's all these little glitches, and it's not the same on everyone's account. Oh, that's really lame. And there's some people in the Facebook group that were saying that they couldn't change their shipping policies either, and then I told them what we had to do, and they had to do the same thing, but not everybody had that same problem. Isn't that weird? Yeah. You'd think that if, if there was a glitch, it would be, like, worldwide. Mm -hmm. Site-wide is what I meant to say, but no, I don't know. I don't, I, I don't pretend that I know. All right, what do you think, JB? So we have this picture here. The front photo it looks pretty too PC, right? Um, we list directly from eBay. Tommy's calling BS. It happened to him too. It's not just me. It's not a woman thing. I know that's what you're thinking. <laughs> it happened to Dan today because he used to think it was a me thing, and he was like, "Amy, hey, just click right here." I was like, "Uh huh." I stood right behind him. Yeah, just... I, I did. I tried to change the cost to co change the shipping cost for the single item in the new listing tool and it, it didn't it definitely did not work and then i also tried to create a new shipping policy from that same screen and it also definitely did not work nothing it just didn't work yeah we're on mac but dan was on pc today yep I use eBay. I import, I do everything starting in eBay. I don't start in Vendu ever. So I totally get what, you, what Matt and um, Tommy are saying, but I didn't know that because eBay didn't alert me. I pushed done and I went on to the next listing. Nothing stopped me from doing what I was doing. That's the only thing I'm saying. Now I know if it doesn't stop me, even if it doesn't stop me, if there's an offer out, but it's really hard to figure out what I have offers out on. Like, that was another problem I was having because I couldn't figure out where to find that. Because I send out offers all day, like hundreds. 
sometimes in a day. Yeah. Not as many recently, I'm, I will admit, because there haven't been many coming through. But normally I send out, I don't know, 20 offers in the morning, 20 in the afternoon, 20 in the evening at least. So I had no idea what I had sent out offers on. I was like, Rrr. At least in Poshmark, you can just go to the offers thing and see. I couldn't find anything like that on eBay. I, it could be user error, I will admit. So I just used the rejects. That's what I was using as my basis. There could have been more than the 12 as well. I just used the rejects. And I figured that was all that was out. So we done messed up. I messed up. Hey. Okay, Tommy says he changed his shipping price twice in the last week. It will not work on our account. I will do it on here in front of you guys so you can see that I'm not lying. In the new listing tool, I used to be able to go back to Classic and do it. I can't go back to Classic anymore. So there's no way to do it other than go to eBay, My Account, Shipping Policies, Create New Shipping Policy. Not in the listing. You have to go back to Ground Zero. That's what I had to do today. Dan did it today. <clears throat> He's walking us through. He's walking us through like we don't know. We just did this. He's like, there's a place called Shipping Policy. Yeah, we, we got it. He said, don't use the listing tool. Why would you even think about doing that? Because, so what happens is, like, look. Because I was listing a one off. I was listing something that was a giant um, touch screen art tablet thing. And I wanted to put $75 ground shipping on it. Okay, but look, this is what we used to do. So we go here. And then we would go edit cost for this listing. Yeah. So you still want to set it first class, but you want to pay a little more. Okay, first class is not a good example. But if this was pri if this was like priority or choose local or whatever, we would go here. Look, I'll do it. Edit cost for this listing. And then instead of twelve ninety nine, I want to charge fifteen ninety nine. Say, okay, I just want to do that for this one listing, right? Yeah. Oh, see, it didn't even give me that when I clicked on it. It gave me it booted me right to the. It's different every time. Yeah, to the create new shipping policy page. And this is what happens. Nothing. Save and close, nothing. Nothing. <laughs> you see this? See how it's happening? Nothing. And then old listing tool used to work perfectly. Kyle says, yeah, I wish that worked. It doesn't work for you either. This used to work in classic. I did it all the time. Yep, me too. Last I checked, Megan said, I have 70 plus listings that are automatically sending out offers. I have no idea which ones are out of the almost 500 or those 70. So I feel that. Yep. So look, it just does this forever. You can't get out of here. Okay. Anyway, uh, I need pictures for the pajamas. Oh, you sent me pictures of the pajamas. Just pointing out glitches here, people. Mm -hmm. Is Are those first class of pajamas? No. Priority. Yep. Anyway, that's why I have priority copy nine. <laughs> <laughs> Look, this is from today. First class copy five, 30 listings. These were all things that had offers out on today. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's fine. Good times. I'll go through and clean it up tomorrow. And then again, I'll just keep cleaning it up until I stop sending out offers over Christmas and then I'll get all get back on track. <laughs> Just end and relist whole store, not a big deal, fix all the issues. It's not a big deal if you're not using it. <laughs> I would have to copy and paste 2100 2, links. Yikes. I'm so glad I don't have glitches. I'd kick babies. I think it's because your store is really small, probably, right? It's easier for you to update things. The thing doesn't get all clogged. What is the thing? What is, what is happening? Are you, are you, oh, my. Are you ready? Yeah. What, okay. no, it's no, a... what is it? I'm asking if you're ready to. I didn't know whether you were going to just send me pictures. No, I'm not okay. there yet. It's a J. Jill 100% silk button down shirt. Yes, in this case. All the way button down? All the way button down. Is it Raylan silk? It's all silk. It's all silk. 100%. What color is that? Like cranberry? Yeah, sure.
3x. J. Jill, women's, 100% socket, women's. Is it roll tab sleeve? Yeah. <clears throat> uh, plus size, what size? I'm sorry. 3X. X. Roll tab sleeve shirt, cran cranberry? Yeah. Nah, it's a little more purple than that, raspberry. <laughs> There's only one man who would <laughs> dare give me the raspberry. I can't. What's the number? <laughs> 70, 20, 30. I had to. It was a softball. You laid it up. I don't know what it is, but I love whatever it is. I literally, I'm a chosen fly. I've maybe even one. It's not you. It's us every two months, and that's it. Oh, gosh. You're so lucky. We don't have a ton, I will say. Like, we don't get all the errors that James gets. Yeah. We do sometimes. But not like that. You know what I mean? But there are certain things, like, freaking that. Not being able to change your shipping price. That's, like, a basic feature that we've been using since 1999 on eBay. <laughs> sends me over the edge. Let me, like, let me know when I can send you pictures. You can send them. Because it's, like... Oh, we're gonna do all these new things and make everything so much better, and it makes us so much worse. I'm like, okay. Oh my God, Matt is quoting Spaceballs as well. <laughs> is it Spaceballs? Yeah. Of course. Yeah, I couldn't. I was just making sure I didn't say the wrong thing. I love a Spaceballs. I was just making sure I wasn't getting it twisted. We were not. Spaceballs is the best. Oh, we we sold our car, like traded in our car and had Spaceball sticker on it, and we like debated over it for a long time. God, we're gonna lose that Spaceball sticker. <laughs> Spaceballs, the bumper sticker. <laughs> it's still so good. <laughs> we almost didn't sell the car because of that sticker. Dang it! Should have saved it. <laughs> First class on it, yeah, I'm sure. <clears throat> yeah. I also don't use desktop for any other shipping, and sometimes you read lists and send offers. Oh, We're like stuck on the desktop. I can't use the phone, I get like very anxious about it. I have to click on everything and I can't see, and it's all my hands are too small. I don't like it. What brand is this? It's the Creek. The Creek. <laughs> 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 Oh, linen blazer. The Creek, y'all. Some of this stuff is good. You said this one's going to be good. You had a feeling about it. I have a feeling about it. Got a feeling. I got a feeling. Exactly right. Okay. Oh, man. It'll be aight. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'll spruce it up. Okay. The patch it. pockets. Right? could be wrong with it. It's linen. Navy blue. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. Show sure color. Right? Who doesn't want this? Everybody wants this. And then the dregs. Oh, God. Not a tapestry. Okay, so nothing sold recently. It's fine. Oh, great. It's fine.
it it will seem to go this size is it 3x Man, your stomach is growling. I know. Are you digesting or hungry? I don't know. Oh no. <laughs> You're in the middle of that. <laughs> no man's land. Um, it might be 70-24. Depends on okay. how compact it is. I think it's pretty. I didn't see anything like it, so we'll be out. I'm always like, check the cops, and I don't listen to them. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah well, can. It, I'll be a little bit facetious and conceited here. Oh. I know about fashion, so I know when something's like good, when it's a good piece, right? So you sure. can price it based on the piece as well, not just on what some other person sold it for who might not know okay. the piece. I think a linen patch pocket blazer is timeless. With a shawl collar, timeless. I'll give you that. I'm going to start timeless. So. <laughs> now, sell through, that's something different. Is it selling? Yes, but how much for is the part where you can get a little wiggle out of it? You know. Mm -hmm. If it's not selling, angle, sell. Are those wooden buttons or plastic? Mm. Are they tortoise shell? I'm not sure. No, but like the co do they have color variation? Yeah, a little bit. Tortoise shell buttons and patch, large patch pockets. Huge! <laughs> I'm going to do it. Do it. Let's see what we can sell it for. Come on. Come on, patch pocket blazer. Classic style. So Sometimes I think the string makes me fierce. It's been known to happen. Okay. Boing, boing, boing. Did something happen, or are you just saying? It? No, I'm just going. Okay. <laughs> just like so sick of listing. <laughs> Checking out this question in the workroom. Okay. <clears throat> 25, 25. Okay. Would you call it what it was a twenty five inch chest in women's? Two X? Three X? Fifty. Yeah, two X probably. I said two X we would say after measuring plus size clothing for the last two weeks. Right? It's a blazer. What's that one measure? 60. This is like oversized though. Um, but normally 50. 30. The 3X stuff we've been measuring has been ranging from over 50. Like okay. 52 to 56. Oh, I see. Okay. So if you want, we do bump that down a little bit. Yeah. So yeah, this is getting 70-24. That's what I put. Cool. Some guy on Macari's price shaming us on our Mickey Mouse 
Station Master hat. <laughs> uh, the last one that sold on here is for 60 Well, the last one that sold on eBay was for 150 So... And guess what? There's nowhere listed, so... Rare. HTF. We'll find someone else to sell it to you for 60 Because we're not going to do it. Not doing it. I'm going to stretch that thing out and hair dryer it on a pot. <laughs> Still on the pot. Still on the pot. <laughs> 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 it was like classic man versus woman thinking. You were like, I'm gonna make something that's exactly the shape. <laughs> Walk right in the Priority. kitchen. Came back in here Boom. with the pot. Got it. <laughs> like surely we have something. It's on the pot. <laughs> Oh yeah, the thing is worth a lot. I hair dryered it to like mold it back into shape. Yeah, you did. From the bit with the bins. Bins. I loaded it at the bins. Bin. I want to go to the bins tomorrow. Should we go since we don't have to do YouTube? Mm, I don't know. No. We gotta check these details. I check that. You did. We're good in the winter. Our seats are gonna look good. It's true. Why does that happen? I don't know. Why would an inside sale matter? <laughs> I think everyone like winds down. Like the month of December, people are like, "Whoa, holidays!" <laughs> like, what? Huh? It's also the end. We need holidays. Well, I mean, I guess it's harder to get people to come out Why? to them if they're everyone's busy with family. Why it's, are you busy with family? Ten days holiday. before the holiday. Well, ten? No, you're not ten days before. I, I, I agree. With you. There's not that many good estate though. Though starting in November, it's like womp womp. <laughs> So I want to go to the bins. We waste time at the bins, though. And I've been on the roll with, like, doing the 30s. We probably shouldn't. Oh, God. But we can't go to the bins. Pictures coming. Pictures coming. Pictures coming. Thank you. I'm just going to keep going. This is fine. We'll get into the stuff I steamed. Yeah. Steam it. Everything's going slow. Oh, here they come. I got them. Got them. Got them. Did you make them look good? I hope so. Trying to upsell them. Oh, yeah, it looks all right. You mad at it? List it. List it. What is it? This is Bloomingdale's 1X. Sun. Is it cotton? Feels, feels kind of like cotton. Uh, it's got a style number and a cut number. It is 100% tensile. Style number is 38236G 840. It's like That's a, a lot. It's got an item number too. I, I, this is a lot. It's just from the nails. Oh, it's coming up as bed sheets. Perfect. Y'all, are you watching White Lotus? It's so weird to show. I don't know what's happening. Please, someone explain it to me. We haven't finished it yet, so don't no spoil anything. No spoilers. Please, don't spoil it. We're probably going to finish it tonight or this weekend. Oh, really? How many episodes do we have left? I don't know. I think there's only... If there's eight, we have like three more. Okay. We're definitely finishing tonight. We're just gonna watch it one at night. Yeah. Can you pick it from the side? Sure. Yes. Because there's no booming dolls. This is going to be an issue. Just great. What is 
现场。What's the number? Seventy twenty five. Apostrophe. Oh yeah. Sorry. Is anyone in the chat going? I'm talking to myself. It's fine. If everybody's working. That's great. <clears throat> but I could be logged out. Sometimes that happens. Well, you don't get chat messages. Yeah. What's the last one you see? Chilling. Sleeveless in all caps from JB. No, I'm not getting anything. No wonder I thought I was sitting over here by myself. Oh, man. What's happening? What's the last thing you see? Desktop from Tommy. I was talking to myself over here. Thank you, JB. Why? Sometimes I get logged out of chat. That's weird. Tommy's going to be like, you don't get logged out of chat. <laughs> <laughs> that never happens. <laughs> it's your eyeballs. We did hit it with a hairdryer. Okay. Tommy said he uses stylus with an iPad. Works amazing. Watching, he watches a guy in the UK list with it, and it's blazing fast. I have an iPad and a... You get the um, full website with the iPad. I have an iPad and a pencil. Yep. Matt says he's debating buying himself a Microsoft Surface or tab tablet to but use. But how do you, like, type in all what you want to type in? You, like, hit the keyboard. No. But it's just so damn convenient. And then, of course, Dan's hungry. He hasn't had bread in, like, what, five years? <laughs> <laughs> I'd be famished. <laughs> oh, my God. Ah, oh, and uh, Tommy said on the, and on the next episode after Amy overprices everything, eBay is slow, like dead slow. Stay tuned. Hey. Hey. I think you're wrong. Teresa, is that true? No bread. That is true. We're keto. Have been for like four years. Tommy's asking Matt if he's heard from Yakov. No, he's gonna message him. <laughs> You still getting no comments? Nothing. You'll think that overpriced everything, but then it sells. Hey, Angela, she made it. Yeah. There's a typo in the description. You forgot the E for sleeveless. I got it. I got that. Got it. Okay. Hello, David. David's here. What's up, David? Okay. Can you like, make I gotta... the comments work? I don't, I don't know. Well, how are people going to troll me if I can't read it? Yeah, you're right about that. We're going to have to kick Amy out for a second. Get out of here. <laughs> we have to go there. Leave. And then let's make this work. Lord. Oh, yeah, I don't know what's happening. On my listing window. Come on now. Reshare the screen. Hopefully that'll do it with your messages. And they're back. She's back. Sounds like a vortex. Tommy, we don't use StreamYard. We use freaking Restream. Because of you. <laughs> is he now saying, like, should he stream? Like, <laughs> no, you're using StreamYard. Maybe it's better. I told you better. Why you don't use StreamYard? God. I don't want Okay, do you, are you getting comments? No. JB says you fixed the typo in the title, but not the description. Thank you. Thank you. Nothing? Nothing. I got nothing. Perfect. Nothing from David? Nothing. Oh. Hey, David. Appreciate you. Hmm. If only we streamed here, this would all be taken care of. 
this wouldn't happen on mobile, you know. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see if we can get you comments this way. Yeah, we didn't do this one time earlier. Doesn't make it to watch ourselves at all. There you go. Okay. Oi, mate. Tommy said I overpriced things too. I just like to give her a hard time. <laughs> I think, I think honestly, this plus size stuff is worth a little bit more. I was hesitant to say it because I hadn't sold enough of it. But I think the sizes and the styles that we're putting out there, they're worth a little bit more than the, I wouldn't, I don't know, like medium. I just don't think they make as many and there's not as many available. The supply and demand as I look at the comps, the plus sizes I've always sold for more and there's less of them available. Okay. So that's why I'm in particular a little bit overpricing these. I just think they have more value. It's similar to petites. You go to the petite section and there's like one extra small petite, one small, one medium, one large petite, one extra large petite, and that's it in yeah. the whole store. Yeah. And there'll be like 17 mediums, 17 large, you know what I mean? I think the supply is much lower so that the, the demand is higher and then I think the price is a little bit higher. I've been hesitant to talk about it because I just didn't know if that was the case, but I feel like it's the case because I'm pricing higher than comps and the stuff is selling. <clears throat> I'm taking offers. It's not, not all of it, it's only full price. Let's no, I'm I'm in now. I'm watching the YouTube comments live. In the control room. I'm in the control room. <laughs> Beam me up, Scotty. I can see them now. Let them work around it. Go figure. See, Tommy said I price up all the white shoes. I would too. The, the supply is so little and everybody got white feet, says me. And Matt prices them up too. Well, the higher I get in size, like with this lot, the 4Xs sell more than the 3Xs sell for more than the 2Xs all and down the line. It's just how it is. And there's just not a lot in this. Every time in this J. Joe, particularly your soft surroundings, if you look for plus sizes in the sold, there's nothing. And then I list it and it sells. So it's not like people aren't buying the plus sizes. They're just not available. So I think it's a really good hot tip. Look for plus sizes. I think the same thing would support for petites as well. But look for non-traditional sizing in these mall brands and they do a lot better. I mean, I'm kind of an expert now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not at all. But we listed 200 pieces, so I feel more okay to talk about it at least. Yeah. When we first got it, I was like, oh, I don't want to say anything. I don't, I don't know. I don't know yet. I don't know for sure. I can <laughs> say all this crap, and then it never sells, and I'm like, eee. Same with men's four extra large and five extra large. I crank the prices on them. Yeah, I mean, it just it's got to be a supply and demand thing. Because the way I see it, some people are like, oh, America, everyone's bigger. That is kind of true because we were in Mexico and these people were my size. Like all the waiters and everything were my size. Did you notice that? Yeah. And all the Americans were like towering over them, like corn-fed Americans, yes. <laughs> like as people would call them, you know. But at the end of the day, they wouldn't make more mediums and larges, like standard mediums and larges, if they wouldn't, if they weren't going to sell them, right? They would just make more plus size, and they don't. I just think it's a supply and demand thing. Oh, 
both Amandas are here. So cute. Hey. Matt, let me know if you find them. Oh, men's. They don't, I can't find the women's ones. And if I do, they probably look like clown shoes. I'm probably like not into it. <laughs> I have some. I got some of the ultras from Thread Up that Tommy told me to get, and they're so ugly. I know you told me they were ugly, but I didn't believe they were as ugly as they are, but they're very ugly. Whoa. The red ones? Yeah. <laughs> they are actual clown shoes because they're red as well. And they came while we were away, so now I can't return them. I have very large clown shoes in my closet. <laughs> I need to just sell them. They were so ugly. I know I was warned. But you wasn't ready. I was not even a little bit ready for that. All right, what is this? This is a J. Jill 100% linen. Um, oh, just buttons so all the way down, tunic. But it's just a, in XL. Also, more fabric means higher cost to produce. True, true. True. You know, people that make a great income just go off going to retail stores, Ross, Burlington, etc., and getting the hot air balloon size Ross <laughs> and send to Amazon. The, the ROI is sick. But Amazon, I've never done it, but isn't their payout so super low? Balloon bras. I buy those too. I love buying large bras. <laughs> One of my favorite things to get at the bins. Oh my God, I need to stop. Is it love linen? Or is it pre love no, linen? It's pre. This linen, J. Jill, goes for more as well. I will say. Oh, not on small light items. Oh, that's so strategic. I see. Long. Long. Yeah. Well, it's 31. It's not too long. Oh, it's not? Okay. Alright, what's the number? 7026. So the comments are very small. <laughs> Wrong one thing. <laughs> uh, Amanda, come on, move my card and you hit me. <laughs> There's two Amanda's here. You get double the help. Boulder holders. I love it. There's this one type of bra called, um, I always look for it. Y'all need to look for it called She Fit. It sells so freaking fast, it's like within 10 seconds. It's remember that sports bra I got? Yeah. And the bigger you can get it, I had like a quadruple F or something like that. It was huge. Or I. It was like, I didn't even know the name. Baby. Yeah, it was. Yeah, I think it was a G. <laughs> anyway, man, she fit sells so fast for so much, like fifty bucks. I've never had something sell so fast in my life. I was like, oh, so then I look for it all the time. I have never found it again. But I just bought it off instinct at the thrift. I was like, this feels real nice. Let's get this because it was on half price day. And now I never found it again. And I'm hoping I'm telling you the right brand. <laughs> I think it was called she fit. I don't remember. I know you're shocked. Megan yeah. got Megan got five listings drafted. Just need photo skews and measurements. Yes. So in our world, we call that processing. I know that's not what most people call it, or we call it like skeleton drafts. And so since April's been taking pictures for us, um, we've had to do it in reverse, and that's been a huge learning trying to figure out your pro you have one process right you do it year after year after year and then you change one thing and you have to switch around your order and it's 
for me, and Dan, Dan has not been affected one little bit. <laughs> He's over there just blinking. Like, uh -huh. For me, it's been very interesting because you guys know I'm always talking about I can't list without the item in my hand. I did have to go get four items today to feel them, but for the most part, I've been listing from the pictures instead of doing the drafts first, and it's been working out. Yeah. I haven't been comping as much. I just go with my gut. I'm just like, well, I've sold this enough. I think this is what it's worth. And even on here, on this live, I haven't been comping as much as I usually do. And also, we had so much less money into this stuff that I kind of like in pricing everything at like thirty nine ninety five or forty four ninety five. It's forty four ninety five. You know. Yeah. So you don't really need to comp it once you've listed it a million times. For sure. Day. So she listed a bunch of stuff that was in her death pile. Now I, that's probably going to be different. I'm probably going to be like, oh. <laughs> What is this? I got a size. Hold on, I'm gonna go get them. Hold on. I think I got a six, but they're actually very wide. What are you getting? Are they ugly red shoes? <laughs> you know, right. Man, look at these clown shoes, though, y'all. These are terrible. Hold on, can you put me on the screen? Huh? Yeah. I don't know if they'll be like, well, they could probably see them. They're huge. Huge. So they're actually too wide for my feet. I mean, my feet, okay, let me rephrase. They're probably not too wide. They just were like wide. And then they may look up because normally I squeeze my foot in. What are these called? Lone Peak. Look how big those are. Super wide. My foot had room in it. I have never had room in a shoe in my life. Normally my foot is like, oh. I'm spreading out my toes and everything. I got a size wow. six. EU 37. Man, they are wide though. <laughs> Gator trap on the back. Like, oh, man. I am a fashion conscious person. I know they don't show that on YouTube, but in my life I am. To have gator track on trap on the back of my <laughs> shoe. Uh. On the back of my my clown shoe. <laughs> the fact that they're red makes it worse, I'm it, sure. It does. It absolutely does. But you are right, they're super wide. I bet they would be really comfortable if I did wear them. If I could get past the <laughs> the look of it. <laughs> look, it's all wrinkly. <laughs> it's like super wrinkly. Also, Thread up sent these like dirty AF. I'm kind of shocked. Don't worry, a bed bug tied these up in a bag. I'm worried. Anyway. Hi, Susan. Ready to go back up? Lone Peak. Lone Peak. Lone Star. Those are trail shoes. You need the Paradigm 6. You sell the red ones for 70 plus? Can I resell them? Because I did not pay that. I paid $20 for them. Oh, man. Wait, I got to remember what you said. Paradigm 6. I'm actually just going to type it on my notes because they keep taking pictures of these chats and they don't know what's happening. Paradigm. Just type it up into eBay right now. No, I'm not. I list this stuff. All right. All right. Shoes. I got some pretty killer shoes from Startup, actually, though. They're like a no name Chuck Taylor situation. They're pretty sweet. They definitely don't fit me, but I'm still wearing them. Dang it. David, you're so nice. They look nice, Amy. You're just too nice, David. Those are clown shoes. What is this? <laughs> Uh, this is a soft surroundings. Oh, soft surroundings are switching it up. 100% tensile button front uh, tunic. Definitely a tunic. Oh, yeah, we're going to be live next week. We don't really celebrate holidays. We're just not those kind of a people. Sorry about it. I told Dan, we need to like, hit the ground. Are we road tripping this year? 
Yeah, we're going to road trip. We'll look at the prices, but I think we're going to road trip. Okay. We're going to drive Myrtle Beach. Woo. It's a long one. Stuff in, in, in the oh, yeah, I need to talk to him. Talk um, to him. What size is this? 1X. Mandarin color? Yeah. I got it here. See, no results found. What's up, Mark? How you doing? In my no insole death pile. Well, what do you put inside it? I mean, I do have insole, but they're only half. Do people buy shoes without insoles in it? I've heard of people selling them, but I just didn't believe them. I guess if you have like an orthotic or something, I don't have that. Yeah. Probably should. Oh god, I can't find with a manner collar. I don't know. I've never looked at one of these. Oh god. Oh god. What size is it? One. Oh, runners get custom. I see. I mean, you know me, and I'm just such a runner. <laughs> <laughs> Nike. <laughs> Don't laugh so hard. That was rude. <laughs> I mean, I, I, the same thing could be said about me. I'm such a runner. <laughs> you know. Just as funny. This is the insult gets funny. Oh, that's why I don't like wearing other people's shoes. I did buy them, but I don't like wearing them. Purple. Tunic top button front, blouse, mandarin collar. Um, okay, what's the number? 7027. Priority. What? Just over. Wow. Well, what if you took that bag and replaced it? Huh? Mm -hmm. Wow. Man, see, that, that affects my price because you know they take eight million for shipping mm -hmm. so you can't price it yeah you can do that nope. yeah i think it's because it's tinsel it's yeah. pressed plastic yeah <laughs> get you every time I wish I could split the diff, you know, and like, yeah. Look at it, it's like seven dollars or something. Just it's gonna be a hard sell. It wants to pay eight ninety nine for a shirt delivery. Do the spray on Amazon on ten seconds. I use that for stuff that doesn't get a full wash. Oh. <laughs> oh man, Susan's video looks blurry. It oh, should no. be better on our end because Tommy said it's clear on his end. He had fixed the internet today. He had to call the mesh people. Yeah, I had to fix the setting. There was some or... weird setting that wasn't like before I switched the setting. I was literally doing a speed test on the PC, which is plugged into the mesh thing. It was giving me like 1.8 megabits upload speed. 1.8. It took us four hours to upload a video <laughs> yesterday. That was 30 minutes. I was like, this is not good. After the setting change, I'm in the five to six hundreds, which is better. But I'm paying for a gig, so I've never, ever in my life gotten a gig. No. No, of course not. We packed 610 boxes of food tonight. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Wow, nice. That is so great. I would love to do an organization like that. Wow. What kind of food was in it? I'm just curious. Is that rude? I don't know. Like, was it perishables? Do you have to keep it cold? That's my question. Maybe you want to answer. Oh, Dan's going scarfing again. <laughs> Scarf to finish out the night. Do we know the brand? This one's a Sundar. Oh, yeah, yeah. 100% linen. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. 
Dan is going scarfing. <laughs> <laughs> the one you did where it was like all like fluffy, that was the one people like. What was all like big like gravy, that? Yeah, big, big. Are you getting nervous that you can't replicate it? Yes. Because <laughs> it's not, this one's not as wide as the cashmere one. Oh, okay. And it's linen. So it's a little you know, stiff. Yeah. I'm just looking at it. I'm going to try to see the solds and see what they're so Nothing on eBay selling. We really need to get these up on some higher end platform. Nothing is selling on eBay. The only one that sold it sold for 80. Wow. Yeah. <clears throat> It's just not the right platform for these carbs. Yeah, no kidding. With canned goods, drinks, rice, beans, pasta, cereal, etc., plus tomatoes, meat, veggies, eggs, some dairy items, and bread. That is so fantastic. Wow, that's such a blessing. I can only imagine like some people are so thankful. Wow. That's such great work. Thank you for doing that. Sometimes when I give compliments, they sound backhanded, but I actually mean it. Like, gosh, it makes, like touches me. Thank you. So the two Eskandars that have sold have been sh same seller, and they've been looking like this. Like that? Mm -hmm. Kind of like what I'm doing. All right. Kinda. Of. Put the tag that right out in front there. There you go. There you go. That's what eBay camp should be like: packing boxes for homeless people or something like that. You know. That's eBay camp. Everybody get together and do like a service project. That'd be awesome. This is our linen scarf. Navy blue stripe. Oops. Made in Italy. Navy blue stripe made in Italy. So we're about 600 families per month, and it was so fulfilling. Just started year seven. All community donations and grants to fund. Oh my gosh, it's amazing! And it's so funny because you know, like, oh, with fringe. Sorry, you know how people would be like, oh, all the resellers are taking from the needy, and the reselling community, for the most part, is some of the most giving and loving and charitable people I've ever met. Like we're the last people that are stealing <laughs> from the homeless. I think we're always trying to give back. In fact, we're trying to like save homeless clothes at the most, you know, at the end of the day, we're trying to like save stuff from going to the landfill. So it's, I think it's just inherent in resellers. Most resellers that I know at least are just like really good people. When Hope's thing was coming out and I put it in our group to like, or and I put it in our video to go donate to her GoFundMe for her cancer, so many people donated to Hope from our group and they didn't even know who she was. Just people were like, oh, I saw you in the Hustle Couple, many blessings, many prayers. They did not even know her. And they were still donating money, like tons of people. And I was just like, this is an amazing community. That's awesome. 
I know. It's like such an amazing community. But we get such a bad rap, like from mainstream, you know? <laughs> oh, I love all this. Yes. That's a really good response. When people ask me what my job is, I, I don't say reseller. I say I save clothes from ending up in the landfill, clean them up, and sell them. That's, that's true. Most people don't know what a reseller is anyway, but everyone on the earth is a reseller when you actually think about capitalism. Everybody's reselling. Unless you're a manufacturer, you're a reseller. So... Yeah, in one way or another. Right. Okay. What's the number? 7028. What's the width? Oh, did you write that? 84 by 18. Rehab clinic. <laughs> <laughs> that says I rehabilitate unwanted shoes. <laughs> Can we all have a tagline? I love it. Yeah. We provide items that many working people have no time to find for themselves. Absolutely. We do not serve just low income. We service food insecurity. No names, no ID, no proof of income. I love it. Maybe we are sick and missed a week of work and had. To get your car fixed, if hungry, exactly right. I love it. Shouldn't matter. So I was watching the Stanley Tucci show that got canceled. Oh, so mad! Great show. So mad about it. I'm gonna put this at 199 and see if we can move this thing. Oh. And really, it's not cashmere. Okay. I'm telling you, the only ones that have sold are sold for 70 and 60. Okay. Um, it's better than sitting here. That's true. So anyway, in Napoli, in Naples, which is coincidentally where my family's from, it's a very charitable community, and everyone, for the most part, in all of time in Naples has been quite poor. And so when you go get like a cup of coffee, you can get one for you, and you can say like put one on reserve. It's so cool. So you'll be like, buy, I'll take one coffee and one on reserve. And then... It's like the ultimate pay forward. Yeah, yeah. So, like, when somebody comes up and needs a coffee, it's not in coffee, grocery stores, too. When somebody comes up and needs something, somebody's already paid for that ahead of a time. And they can just... Ugh, make me cry. I can't tell my mom. <laughs> I can't. I mean, it's, like, such a wonderful thing. And everyone does it. <clears throat> Some days you have enough to give one on reserve, and other days you need to take one, you know? It just depends on how your day's going. But whatever. It's just so lovely. I think this one showcases it a little more. The color. I'm going to do that. Okay. <clears throat> just try to get this thing sold because. Hey, <clears throat> 200 bucks is better than no bucks. Oh, man. Each of the friends. Material linen. It's a hundred percent linen. Yep. Oh, show. Listed. Listed. Let's see how many we got done. Here. Yeah, man. How we do? Up. 
will prepare for a slice of pizza and soda and then they put up on a wall and it says take them if you need it. Oh, I love that. I love it. <clears throat> I don't know what David's commenting to Tommy. I need to trace that back. It's huge in London. Seeing that happen here. Seeing what happen? Oh, I need my glasses. All right. Let's see here. I'm going to import these. Do it. How many we'd get done? I don't know. I, try, I was trying to keep up with the comments. <laughs> to do it I got lost and eBay how many you think we did um 11 or 12. yeah catch up with the comments bruh <laughs> I'm I can't, you know I'm blind and I can't wear my glasses because they're ring light. It's bad. And then he put me on this little screen. It's, whoa. I don't see a comment from Tommy that David's responding to. I went all the way back up. So unless I just like skipped out on him. It's fine. Mm-hmm. And it it's fine. <laughs> and it rough. David loves saying that word. <laughs> There's like this chavy guy on um White Lotus. Um White Lotus. Oh my god, he's so chavy he's in it. <laughs> he really does. <laughs> so oh, these pajamas were for me. <clears throat> So I found the tops to these, these crunchy dead pajamas. Uh oh, Tommy got some Brooks Ad Adrenaline Twenty Twos in a size six wide out of a bag. He just pulled out of a bag for you. Awesome! Put them in your store and send me the link. Go buy them. I will, but I don't even know what they are. What are they? Are they ugly? You're gonna think they're ugly, yeah, because they're running shoes. Yeah, <laughs> I used to wear running shoes, and I, I was having none of it. He wasn't trying to be mean about it, but he's not a runner. So he would like wear them with tall socks. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that. He doesn't anymore. He's much better dressed. <laughs> True. He used to wear like rubber wristbands all the way down to his elbows. Like, trying. Hey. You're too attractive to me, Jameis. Guy. Have a good weekend. Yes, everybody have a good weekend. And Melissa just popped in. Hi. Hey. As usual, you're fun. <laughs> <laughs> no, I want I want to look like Chucks or Vans or something, but they just don't. I don't know. I'm like a little rocker chick. I don't I don't want to wear running shoes. I just can't run. <laughs> But I sometimes, like when I'm cleaning the garage, I have to have a pair of shoes that fit me. Or if I'm at the bins, yeah, I gotta just cut cut my ties. Because at the bins, my feet start hurting so bad, and if it interrupts my shopping, I have an issue. Yeah, because I can shop for like 12, 15 hours straight. Yeah, but once the, once the toes start hurting, it's Ooh. done. It's over. I'm like, I told Dan, I'm like, we gotta go. My feet hurt, and he's like, Oh no! <laughs> That's the only reason I'm trying to get some shoes that fit for extraneous activities. I say, I don't know what I'm trying to say. Aw, y'all are so sweet. All right, good night. Everybody, all right. Send her the link to those shoes, though, Tommy, for real. Yeah, I'll So buy she it. can check them out. You don't even have to take real pictures. Just, like, put a... He, he only takes one picture of the one shoe anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Called out! <laughs> All right. Everybody have an awesome, awesome weekend, and we'll see you guys on Monday. Bye.